Hi, my name is Wayne Adrian Davis. I'm an educator by profession. I'm the founder and principal of Bright Future School, which is located in Ethiopia, which has five campuses here in Addis and in Awasa, and 2,500 students from pre-kindergarten to grade 12. Uh, today, I'm talking about my passion. My, my real passion in life is scouting, and I've volunteered uh, more than half my life in, in scouting and I'm a member of the Ethiopia Scout Association. Uh, the Ethiopia Scout Association uh, was established in the early 1900s but unfortunately was disbanded by the communist regime, the very communist regime for over 30 years and we re-established it in the, in the late 1990s and we rejoined WOSM in the year 2002. So from year 2002 until year 2009 I served as the International Commissioner for Ethiopia from 2009 uh, July until 2015. I served as the Chief Commissioner of the Ethiopia Scout Association. Meanwhile, I was elected in 2012 during the 15th Africa Scout Conference as the member of the Africa Scout Committee. And in 2015, I got re-elected as the Chairman of the Africa Scout Committee. Currently, I'm serving as the Chairman of the Africa Scout Committee and I'm responsible for 38 NSO together with my team that is 38 NSOs within the Africa region. Uh, what we call the Africa region is not the entire African continent but the sub-Saharan Africa that's including um, South Africa. Uh, North Africa belongs to the Arab uh, region but sub-Saharan Africa belongs to um, the Africa region. We have 38 NSOs and member NSOs of WISM that is and nine potential uh, members, which means we are hoping these NSOs will join WASM in the near future. Um, we have about 8 million uh, members. Uh, I can't say for sure because we don't have a very strong database, uh, census database system, but we do from the census that have been taken through the years, we have uh, calculated that it will be about 8 million. Uh, recently we had the census in Kenya and Kenya registered about 1.4 million making it the largest scouting NSO in Africa. Um, Africa, since the, the, the continent is uh, you know the second largest continent in the world and very large region, we have divided scouting into five zones within this region. We have the West African zone, East African zone, Central African zone, Southern and the Indian Ocean. And these zones have their own sub-regions where they do much of the activities together. Uh, we, I, as member of the Africa Scout Committee, we are responsible uh, in the governance of scouting within the region, development of scouting within the region, and we closely work with the Africa uh, Region Support Center, which is under the World Scout Bureau, uh, which is governed. As you all know, our vision for 2023 is by 2023, scouting will be the world's leading youth movement enabling 100 million young people to be active citizens, creating a positive change in their communities and in the world based on shared values. And for that to happen, we, scouts of the world, should work together. We need to get together, we need to work on our numbers, work on our quality of programs, sharing experiences. I know the Boy Scouts of America has one of the best programs in the world and having this shared with different NSOs, especially smaller, younger NSOs within Africa and other regions will help scouting to grow at global level. And for us to reach 100 million active citizens not just member scouts, not just those who wear the uniform and say I was a scout once, but people who are making and changing their communities positively. Uh, this is the only way we can do it. So sharing the experiences, doing things together and working together for one common goal of creating a better world. So for me, that is one of the biggest things we can do, all of us together, to support world scouting. The second thing uh, we can do together to support world scouting is, I think, uh, at grassroots level, uh, that is to say, at group level where um, young people can do exchange amongst e each other in terms of cultural exchange, knowing uh, each other's cultures, backgrounds, environments, and uh, how they do scouting within their uh, localities. Uh, for example, a group in Ethiopia or Kenya or Tanzania can uh, work together with a group in New Jersey, in California or Colorado on um, Skype calls, emails, even uh, snail mail, uh, old way, you know, the traditional uh, letters, 
to, to see how they do. And they can also do projects together, environmental projects, social community projects, uh, and they can use the scout.org uh, platform to kind of facilitate this uh, for them. And we as leaders can uh, help them in, in guidance and you know, kind of supporting and motivation. Uh, the other thing we can do is joint uh, projects in the Better World Framework, that is the MOP Initiative, the Scouts of the World Award, and the World Scout Environmental Program. These are uh, a WOSM uh, designed global programs that we have, but we can create projects under them and do joint projects. This is mainly institutionalized and it can be BSA with Ethiopia Scout Association, which is also called ASA or you know, Ghana or Nigeria and do together uh, for uh, at national level for our uh, scouts. Um, other, other things I think we can do are uh, attending regional events, national events, especially uh, Boy Scouts of America, young people. Uh, they have a lot to, to contribute to uh, the world in terms of scouting, you know, the, the level of quality, as I said, of programs and uh, experiences that they have. And other uh, NSOs can, can share, can take something, some learning from that, and of course share other sites that Boy Scouts of America young people don't get. And uh, we have, for example, in Africa, we have regional and zonal uh, conferences, uh, youth forums, um, jamborees, and young people can come and participate in those and that can definitely help uh, support uh, world scouting to grow and hit that 100 million quality scouting throughout the world. I really thank you for your attention and if you have any questions please feel free to email me and uh, we are ready to work together and I wish you a great great uh, session this program that uh, you're conducting right now. God bless you. I'm Wayne Adrian Davis.